Hey, hey, hope you're having an amazing day. I'm just gonna quickly show you a stylescape that I've been working on for a client. And this is for a new service that I'm offering, which is actually creating YouTube channels for um, certain small businesses that are starting up on YouTube. So it's a whole you know design package where I help them create a banner and you know a bit of a logo and some uh, thumbnails and stuff like that. So I'm just gonna show you some of the stuff here, which I've done recently. This was kind of fun to do. So this channel is all about um, creating, you know, talking to local businesses and keeping it local, you know, keeping it raw and, and authentic and really trying to promote um, West Chester, which is a suburb in um, around New York. So it's promoting that suburb and um, the clients are real estate agents. So, you know, they want to promote homes as well. So this is like a catalyst to promoting the area and people buying homes, etc. So you can see he went for a whimsical look here got some images, put some patterns, and I added a multiply in the back there just to make it, like, give it a whimsical look. Then did, like, an example of, like, a thumbnail, how a thumbnail could look. Because it's a YouTube channel, I want to add some elements that actually will be on the YouTube channel. I went for both green palettes. I probably should have done another palette. Um, I actually changed this to blue um, on the next round, but, um, but yeah. And I put a bit of a logo here, playing around with some typography, some elements, some arrows that maybe we could be used. So I add elements that I can actually use in the channel. And then the second stylescape, I loved this one. You can see playing with typography, maybe a little icon or something like that. Um, I really love the colors here, it's really awesome. And then got some texture, using some graphical elements to anchor the text there. Keeping the palette really minimal, earthy tones, uh, primary green color and just some cream colors. And then you can see here, I didn't full cut it. Sometimes I cut out an image like this, but sometimes you can just put it within a shape, like just keep it simple because then it'll take you some time to cut it out in Photoshop or if you go remove it on one of those app things. And you can see here, example of like an overlay. You can see I've, I just got multiply and color. So I don't have to go to Photoshop and like do a duo tone just quicker. And um, yeah, example of the pattern use as well, which it looks amazing, which looks amazing. Um, and yeah, and just playing around with some multiply, some typography here and using keywords. And, um, and that's pretty much it. That's what I presented. And then I had like a cover image. So as you can see here, um, some of the layout there. Thanks for my contact details. So let me know your thoughts on these stylescapes. Do you feel like it was enough? Do you feel, feel like they were too simple? They're, these are really dialed down stylescapes because this client, it's a new service that I'm offering. So what's happening if we're doing like a, a pilot run, a, a, a trial run type of thing. So I didn't want to spend too much time on the stylescapes, but you can see here, they still look great. They still look good and, um, and the client enjoyed them. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit the like button, subscribe and comment because it helps the video grow. And I love making videos for you guys and I want to create some more stuff. If you like seeing stylescapes, let me know in the comments below. If you want to see more of this stuff and hear me talk about client work or side projects and that type of thing, and that'll be awesome. So have an awesome day and I'll catch you in the next one.